Hey, just thought I'd do a really quick recap on everything that's been happening. Been back in Australia now for a couple of days and settling in and it feels so good to be eating more food again. Just want to firstly all say thanks so much to everybody for all their support um, through this season. Seven shows in the last five months and ten shows over the last year. So my body's pretty wrecked. In all honesty, I do feel a little bit disappointed in my own personal performance. I'm not unhappy with the placing. I'm, I, I notice there's a little bit of controversy over social media and stuff like that. I haven't really been too active on it to be honest. I've been just sort of traveling around so much and basically the last couple of days uh, has been just good to catch up on some sleep to be honest. Um, just so wrecked from everything so it's been good to just get back and, and relax. It really was my goal this season to try and um, make it to the top of the amateur league and get into the pro league but just the standard for conditioning and dryness um, at that level um, I fell just a little bit short of that and you know I didn't quite bring my best and that's pretty much all there is to it. So many people said to me you know you've got the lines, you've got the shape you've got the muscularity and the muscle quality and the posing pretty much everything you need you just got to come in dry and hard and each comp I got a little bit drier a little bit harder a little bit leaner and I just pushed it and pushed it and pushed it but I think after doing seven comps in the last five months I've just uh, after Arnold's I just it's like I just started getting worse it's like my body just started deteriorating and you know it's not like I wasn't trying or anything like that but you know all in all a little bit disappointed that I kind of let myself down but you know also let down maybe a few of my fans who were like really hoping to see me bring my best package and you know I didn't quite do that having said that I didn't do too badly you know in the last two comps that I did both times came runner-up to the guy who ended up going on to win their overall category and the pro card so I didn't miss out by much but I know within myself that I can definitely kick it up another level don't get me wrong finishing third place and second place in two of the biggest amateur shows in the world is still pretty awesome but just I know in myself that in regards to my potential, I don't feel like I got anywhere near it. It was a pretty rushed prep. Um, just got back from Spain in November. I had a month off over Christmas and then straight back into a prep. So, did my first show after prepping for only eight weeks. And that's not normally ideal. I like to do a good 20 to 26 week prep to really dial it in. Doing this recent season was kind of a last minute thing as with the split with the IFBB Amateur and the Pro League last year. It was only announced I think around late October, early November that Classic Physique would now be available to Aussie athletes and me being the kind of person that I am just thought well you know my body probably needs a break but hey. I'm just going to jump in and take that opportunity and so you know not the ideal prep but I'm really glad that I did it still. Pretty happy but I know I can do a lot better with a bit more preparation but I've decided to just take a little bit of time off now and just focus on other things because my body is pretty much wrecked. I think in order to improve on what I already have I definitely need a little bit of time off to reevaluate and put some more work in basically. Um, but it has been an amazing journey and I'd like to say thanks again for everybody for all your support and everybody who's messaged me. I will get back to all your messages. I've just been just been taking some me time the last couple of days and just chilling out. I'll leave you with some highlights. Hope you enjoy.
crazy look crazy classic bodybuilder from Poland one of the highlights actually is like meeting really cool people um, from different cultures different countries and 